This is our patron. Thank you, thank you very much. Invest a lot of money into this club, and we can only promise that we are going to. And the seasonal ticket is what FUFA has advised all professional clubs to have. That when a fan has this ticket. Thank you. Asante sana. Thank you, Mr. Commissioner. Let me start by thanking God who has made this day possible. It's the day that I have been very much looking forward to, just like yourselves. But I thank God that in his timing, he has made it possible for us to meet today. Let me also thank the URA Football Club for raising the URA banner very high in our country. I have heard about this winning team for many years and it is a team that brings us joy and glory as an organization. If I may borrow the words of Nelson Mandela, a great leader of Africa, he says that sports has the power to change the world. I truly share in this belief, sports have a vivid, transformative and unifying power. I'm fully aware that the club activities have, been, uh, have not been spared by COVID-19 and this has increased the club's operational cost. We understand the constant needs to do testing, to sanitize, and to keep safe. So I'd like to pledge our total support to the club. And uh, despite the COVID-19 challenges, the organization will fully support you in any way that we can for us to survive through this difficult time. <laughs> Beyond the SOPs, we will come ideas for development of a sustainable football program, the need for the club to have a permanent home, the issues that have been raised ably by your chair of the board, the board transportation, uh, and all those other needs. I want to assure you, James, and your board that we will share together in this dream of taking this club to another level and we will do everything that we can uh, within our means to achieve these dreams. So I've clearly recorded what your dreams are for the next level and we will sit down and see how to achieve them. Uh, this morning we were privileged to host our patron and took him through the club. It was the official ceremony of uh, handing the club to him. Uh, we are able to take this opportunity to uh, brief him about those things that will take our club and the game of football in this country to the next level. We've talked about the infrastructure. You're all aware we have uh, our land, 10 acres of land in, 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 in Gayaza. And uh, that is supposed to have taken off, but uh, as you realize, there are a lot of challenges in mobilizing the funding. He has promised to work with us and realize our dream. We have also promised, we 
have been promised to have an ambulance at the training pitch. Uh, at this pitch, we have the school, Amsterdam um, is our host, who have been hosting us for the last 10 years. And uh, they requested that it need, it's important to have an ambulance on site whenever training is taking place so that the players, once they get into trouble, they are rushed immediately to hospital. That he has promised to work on. He has also promised to support us in very many aspects. Things that are inhibiting us, we need to bring them to him. If it is about feeding, if it's about training issues, if it's about anything, he has given us total commitment. We spent more than the time that was slated, and I can say it was a very, very, uh, a very, very good function. <laughs> Keep up. Zai. Bom piano. 